why would you try to shoot a three the last six seconds of the game? You need to be trying to go for a layup, get a foul, so we can at least be two points over. So when they give us another seven seconds, we're gonna win anyway. Previously with Peyton and the windshield wipers didn't work. I'm like, hold on now Destroyed my camera. My camera got soaking wet. You are for me boss Hmm, yeah, you gave me order go museum of future boss every time give the order. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, of course You are the <laughs> boss. Oh, I'm the boss <laughs> Try how much money I spent the mile yesterday Darita darita Da -da -da -da. My heart goes. I did some damage, but I ain't do too bad. I'm feeling like Frank Lucas. I'm feeling like an American gangster. We super comfortable on the plane, and it's cold in Chicago too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it looks so good. You pray faster. Here go y'all favorite girl. Hey, I'm back. <laughs> Make sure you're all caught up on the vlogs and let's jump into today's vlog and see what's going on. And happy Thanksgiving to all of my PayPals. Well, it looks like I'm going to be making Thanksgiving dinner all by myself. So, I need to look up some recipes. By the way, do y'all like my new case to five case? Ooh, look at that, that's cute, right? Shout out to Casetify for sponsoring today's video. I love this, very fashionable. I got it in all black and it just has like these Medusa snakes on the back. Um, and these are selling out really, really fast. I think that this case is a bestseller. Um, it protects my phone. I can drop it and um, like face down, I can drop it and the, the case won't crack. I have a 13 Pro. I don't see myself getting a 14. Honestly, I may get a 15 or a 16 when it comes out, but I just use my phone to check my email, text, upload pictures to Instagram, and basically talk to y'all in the comment box. So I'm good with this, but let me tell you guys a little bit more about Case to Five so you guys can check it out for yourself. These are awesome Christmas gifts, by the way, because one thing about it, people gonna always need something to protect their phone. So it's really a really good Christmas gift. Case to Five is the world's most popular tech accessory brand known for their protective phone cases and global collaborations. They have the biggest sale event of the year, and not only that, but they offer 20% more protection. They have a 21 feet drop protection, and their cases are test dropped 156 times. But more than anything, they are sustainable with 51,000 cases recycled. They have cute and functional accessories accessories such as phone straps and phone charms and they are perfect for when you're on the go. Make sure you go to casetify.com backslash Peyton Charles to indulge and get 15% off your purchase. Again, go to casetify.com backslash Peyton Charles to get 15% off your purchase. And thanks again to Casetify for sponsoring today's video. You okay? Uh-oh. Hey, y'all. Good morning. Welcome back to another weekly vlog slash mom vlog. So me and Karen, you guys know that Karen is in town for the holidays. I'm so happy. Um, and we are about to get out and about and do some shopping. I'm um, getting ready to go and get my lips refreshed. And then we're going to take her shopping to Nordstrom. Some Nordies. And, um... She loves Asian food like me, and I'm in the mood for some P.F. Chains. And me and her, when we lived in Memphis, every Thursday we would always go to P.F. Chains. It wasn't nothing special on the Thursday, but we would always go to P.F. Chains on Thursdays. So, today not Thursday. Today is actually Saturday, but still. Um, so, we're going to go to P.F. Chains. And then she did mention when we were... Um, leaving Chicago we passed by Dave and Buster's she was like oh Dave and Buster's I was like you want to go because I ain't been to Dave and Buster's in a long time and y'all know I like to go 
and play basketball when I go to Dave and Buster. So I got a new scent from Twisted Lily. You guys know that I'm partnered with Twisted Lily, so they always keep your girl smelling good every month. So they sent me a new thymine scent. It says, Peyton, we are so excited to be sharing carved oud with you. This scent is the perfect pick for this time of year. Thank you for your partnership. All the best, the Twisted Lily team. So here we go. So this is first smell, first whiff, first impression. This is what the box looked like. I already have a thymine scent. It's um, Royal Sapphire and it smells amazing. So super excited to see what this one smells like. And I'm gonna do my first impression with you guys today right now. Um, and I'm about to go upstairs and take a shower and um, put something on to like, you know, just get out and about with my girl. So this is what the bottle looks like. It's a pretty blue bottle beautiful okay I'm gonna I'm rub it in so it can dry down faster oh my oh we okay so you know i'm a unisex girl the initial sillage is definitely leaning more towards the masculine i could see a man wearing this for sure a woman wearing it i would definitely have to get back with you and let you guys know on the dry down me i like masculine scents but if you are a feminine girl you like fruity you like floral this might not be for you but for me it's right up my alley, baby. I can I can layer this with something else, and you will never know what I got on. So first impression, I love it. I can't wait to see what it does on the dry down, cause right now it's super um, strong on the projection, and I love the packaging by the way. Love this. I don't remember the first one coming like this. Um, love the blue bottle. It's gorgeous. The initial sillage right now is giving um arabic the oud is giving arabic like this is something that i feel like i would have bought and smelled in dubai i love it i love it carved oud so thank you so much twisted lily for keeping your girl always smelling fresh and sexy you guys know you can use my coupon code peyton 10 um to get some discounts off this is a high-end niche fragrance um if you have the same nose as me i i really feel that you will like it but i'm gonna tell you um as it's drying down it's giving more of an arabic type of um scent it's heavy on the oud and it does lean more to the masculine so just keep that in mind i wouldn't blind by this i would definitely get a sample of it and test it out with your chemistry and your scents wear it on your clothes wear it on your skin wear it at night before bed see how it performs on you and then buy the full bottle but yeah anything on twisted little you can use my coupon code peyton 10 to get some discount and money off and yeah let's get ready because <laughs> I'm ready to get my lips refreshed, baby. Gabby, Gabby had quit laser away. So, you know, whenever she comes, I have to make sure I get an appointment because she's that good. She's that girl. You know, ain't nobody doing my lips like Gabby. Oh, this smell good. Oh! Oh, yeah. I like this perfume. I like it. Even though it's old in it, it's subtle. I think it's not like too strong. Hey, pretty girl. Hey. <laughs> Ready to roll? Yep. Shut the door all the way? Yeah, I did. Okay. All right, me and my sister girl is out today. Sister girl. Sister girl. We is it's out today. You you know what? When we leave the mall, we can we can come over here and get your nails done if you want. Yeah. We got to put some in our belly first. You like Texas? Yep. I need 
need to wipe my lens off. You coming here? Mm-hmm. Before mom? Yeah. Hey girl. Always have a baby face. Uh oh, there goes your music. There goes your, there goes your song. Oh, baby, I like it. You're so excited. Don't try to hide it. Don't try to hide it. I'm gonna make you happy. Cake, 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 Watching football, right? Chai, why when you watching football they slow mo when a person getting hurt? I think that that is so inconsiderate. Like we don't need to see him breaking his ankle in slow motion. We don't need to see that. This is why I don't like watching football because y'all do little snaky ass, shady ass shit like that. Like, why would a person need to see a person bone coming out their skin in slow motion? Like, that's just, that's too graphic. I, I can't do it. <laughs> Stop! That's just too much. I could never be, I could never be a football girlfriend, football wife. I could never. Kyrie, you smell so good. Excuse me. That perfume smells really good on you. Thank you. You're welcome. Me 
how my day was and how my lips doing. You the sweetest girl. You, know you take good care of me last time. Mm. I would kiss you, but my lips swollen. But they okay. They feel okay. Ain't no telling what I'm fit be on. I'm beyond all that fuck shit. You hear me? Hey, I'm beyond it. You feel me? Okay, so uh, the lips looking real nice. I'm about to get in the shower. Of course, because I'm wasting water. Carvin's downstairs all comfy in her bed. She wanted to work out. I told her we was gonna work out outside at the gym. She was ready to work out, but I can't work out for two days because I just got my lips done. So, yeah, that's a plus. So I'm just gonna take me a shower. I just finished editing a vlog. It's gonna go up tomorrow. Um, and yeah, I'm about to wash my face and put my little. So I got some. So I went to the pharmacy and got some clindamycin cream. And then what I'm doing is I'm putting the clindamycin on first. And then I'm putting the uh, different, this adapalene. I'm putting the adapalene on top of it. And I'm not moisturizing. I'm not exactly sure if I should be doing it that way. But I had a real bad flare up right here. And then this, I don't know if it's hormonal because... Yeah, I don't know, but I, I got a hormone test. I ordered a hormone test, so I'm gonna take that tomorrow and mail that off so I can figure out what exactly it is. It's like a hormone and like gut test, I think, so to tell me like what's um causing my skin to break out, things that I should be avoiding. So, yeah, we'll take that tomorrow. I don't feel like doing it today, but I did um get some um putting the ice and cream for my face. So this right here, a mess. Got some shit for you to come and get it. I'm at the same age as some of my own. See me when you do your shit. Woo! I see you doing well, baby. Oh, you put the shit together, I can tell, baby. Oh. Is you single or what? Okay, so I want to wear, ooh, I actually have a lot of choices because I've been doing a lot of shopping. Why are you whispering? So, <clears throat> I don't know what the hell I want to wear, honestly. I want to be cute and casual. <clears throat> Cause I might take them. I think I'm going to take my girl to dinner afterwards. I'm going to go to dinner. You know we love to eat. Looks to me as if I have given away a lot of shit that I ain't mean to give a damn way. This one ain't as bouncy as the other one because y'all know how like um when your wig starting to get old, the closure part start getting a little like what's the word I'm looking for? Cause baby, I don't want to use the wrong word and get canceled, child. You get a little rough. I'm gonna say get rough. But yeah, as I was saying, this is that same wig that I wore to Cancun. So this is actually my first time going to a Mavericks basketball game. I saw that they had a game today here and I was like shit why not cuz I actually really like basketball I'm not a football girl at all I can't watch it it's so hard 
clubs. I don't like pe seeing people get hurt. Maybe that's just the empath in me. I don't know, but I don't like seeing people get hurt. It bothers me. because they kind of bruised and then um yeah just lashes and lip gloss because my hair is actually hiding my skin issues are we getting another pimple here we are love that spray a little of this gucci spray a little of this gucci Okay, so when I went to Columbia for my little bouquetion, um, me and my situation, <laughs> it's the fact that I don't be wanting to claim nobody, baby. I, I, I feel like as soon as you put a title on it, it messes shit up. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, when me and my little situation was riding around in a little horse and carriage, it was real romantic. One of the little Colombian girls, she asked me for my Fendi necklace. And I was like, oh, baby, no, I can't give you my necklace, Judge. This was a birthday gift to myself. It was very, it was, you know, it's, it's sentimental for me because I think this is probably one of, one of the nice things. I buy myself nice things all the time. And I always tell you guys to do the same for yourselves. But this is one of the nicer things that I bought for myself. And um, and out of the all, all of the jewelry that I have, I think this is the most expensive and the realest. So anyway, I gave her my Shop Link and Live bracelet. And I told Heaven that I, I did so. And she sent me another one because... I love it so much, y'all. I literally, I love this bracelet. Like, I wear it all of the time. All of the time. I cut the shit out this bob, didn't I? All right, decisions, decisions. What are we wearing tonight? I'm kind of in the mood. I'm kind of in the mood. Do we want to wear this tonight or this again? The carved oud. I wore it yesterday, y'all, and I literally could not stop smelling myself. I think I'm going to put this on because it smells so good. Oh, the dry down. Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It go on real masculine. You be like, oh, I smell like my daddy. But then... The dry down gives like Baccarat. You know how Baccarat get real soft on the dry down? And it's like you can barely smell it. But if somebody walk past you, they be like, holy smokes. Where you going? Because it dry down so soft, you can overspray it. Hey, forget about it. All right, so I'm just going to put this little puffer just puffer vest over this. And I think I'm gonna wear my Givenchy shark boots. Okay, so this is what Karen's wearing. She's fly. North Face hoodie, period. Skinny jeans from Old Navy with the McQueens. Yeah. Okay, and this is the outfit of the night. Okay. Yeah, my lips look so good. Oh, I want them to stay like this, but they're probably not. So in about three weeks, we're going to go get them refreshed again so they can look like this. Because they're not going to stay like this. But what are we wearing? So 
Okay, the turtleneck bodysuit is from Shein. The puffer vest is from Zara. The leather pants, which I love. They're giving very much new glare, but they're from Manier Duvoir. And then we're wearing our shark Givenchy boots. No makeup, just lashes. I'm gonna put some lip gloss over this and yeah. Giving shape, you hear me? Giving shape. We ain't even out in church, she finna take sand. Riding around with F and then we like to hold hands. Both with two sip dot, he ain't need a bed. You look good on camera, baby. Let's go make a film. Hey, how you doing? Okay. Number 26 was pissing me off. Okay, so good game, but they lost. I'm pissed off because those tickets was not cheap. They wouldn't. Um, but you enjoyed yourself? Yep. Huh? Yeah, one. We enjoyed ourselves. It was still a good game, but like they was pissing me off because they was they thought they was Steph Curry all night trying to shoot threes. Baby, y'all are not Steph Curry. This is not a Steph Curry team. This is not Golden State. Y'all are not Golden State. Y'all got to do layups. Y'all got to run up under the goal, up under the goal, and just, you know what I'm saying? Just shoot it over. Just shoot it over the goal. Stop trying to shoot threes. They was trying to shoot threes all night and it was pissing me off. Cal was over there laughing at me because I was cursing. Baby, I was causing the scene. They was making me mad. Like, why would you try to shoot a three the last six seconds of the game? You need to be trying to go for a layup, get a foul, so we can at least be two points over. So when they give us another seven seconds, we're going to win anyway. That's actually what ended up happening to Denver Nuggets. Mind you, Denver had a whole bunch of... Baby, I need to go. I need to, I need to visit them, okay? <laughs> too many sticks. How was that your ops and none of them died? Pussy. Hold up, two more. Hold up, two more. Hold up, two more. You my precious little twin and you know what we locked in. I want better for you. You my twin. You my twin. You my precious little twin. You my twin. You my precious little twin. You my twin. You my precious little twin. You my only twin. sniffles but I like this hair bro I love this hair come on bow cut Bob BCB give it to him 
I went out without a freaking coat on. So now I'm like stopped up. Just gonna put a little bit of this clandamycin cream on my face. Cause you know, Curology uses tretinoin and clandamycin and a niacinamide. I mean, I can make that myself at home, but I'm not using a niacinamide. I'm just using these two. But yeah, tonight was so fun. It was Kyra's first basketball game she ever went to. Um, and I'm glad she got to experience that with her mom. Because I'm hella animated. Like, I always wanted to play basketball. My grandma played basketball. I was definitely intending on having a son and him going to the league. Yeah, yeah. I also wanted to be the first woman in the NBA. Yep. And then Love and Basketball came out and she... Monica was like she wanted to be the first woman in the NBA. I'm like, first of all, who stole my idea? Like, first of all, th this this whole movie about me. Actually, it wasn't, but still, I did want to be the first woman in the NBA. Like, not WNBA. I wanted to be the first woman in the NBA. You know, like changing, like making history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, I get real animated when I watch basketball, especially like when I'm there. You know what I'm saying? Like I be talking cash shit. It's almost kind of good that I don't get floor seats because like I be getting mad. Like number 26, oh, he was making me so mad tonight because he was not landing any of his shots. Especially the threes. Oh my god, it was pissing me off. But when he went for a layup and missed that too, I said, nigga, get out the motherfucking game. Get him out! And then next thing you know, he act like he was hurt and yeah, yeah, cause yeah, they need to stop putting you in. Yeah, sit on down. Take a break. But yeah, it was so much fun. I do hate that I spent all that money and they lost though, but it's it takes nothing away from the experience. Karen enjoyed herself. She spoiled rotten child. I ain't never, I ain't never ordered cotton candy from the person all the way on the other side of the row. We doing this with my credit card. I'm looking like this. But I ain't take my, I ain't take my eyes off that credit card. I said, Kyrie, you a spoiled rotten because me, myself, I would have just, baby, I would have had to get cotton candy from TJ Maxx or Ross at the counter. Because my grandma definitely wouldn't buy me no cotton candy at, at, a, at, a, at a game. Camera is spoiled riding. <sighs> but I'm about to get in the bed. Should I put... Yeah, I probably should put my bonnet on. I bought me a new bonnet. <sighs> Let's see. <sighs> Let me put my bonnet on so my hair will last. Because we want this bob to keep bobbing. Oh, Lord. Help. Wait. Help. Listen, they ain't got no bunny bob. They ain't got no bunny for bob. So this definitely not gonna come off shy. But I feel like my my bob gonna be messed up in the morning. I feel it all in my bones. I feel it all in my heart. I don't want to sleep with this on. I feel like it's going to mess my bob up. Like I just already, I can see it, you know. I'm, I just, I'm about to sleep like this. Like Rita was on Friday. She had this bob. She had this bob on Friday, didn't it? Sure did. Baby, bob shaking and booty. Hey! Hey y'all, good morning. <clears throat> so, 
basically I have a sinus cold. Yeah, me not wearing my coat last night definitely didn't help. It didn't help at all. But yeah, I am um, definitely cough coughing up yellow mucus, so it's definitely a sinus cold. I'm not sure if I'm contagious though. I hope I'm not because I don't want Karen to be sick. But oh, let's get up and make some breakfast. Uh, uh. I love this robe, y'all. As stated in previous vlogs, this robe is from H&M. It also comes in another color. It's like this cream beige gold. I think it matches my quilt on my bed. I think I might buy it. I think I might get the other one too because I love this robe. I decided that I'm going to take these back to Zara because I really need them in a medium, not a large. So hopefully... Um, us going to the mall today is Monday. They would have done like restocks on the floor in the inventory and they should have these in a medium too. <sighs> so what should we have for breakfast? Don't act like you don't do it. You do it. Okay. Let's do some strawberry. Um some strawberry French toast. Ooh, we got some ham. We got some brown eggs and hash browns. Love that. Oh, cheese. Tell them mama, would you like to be my son, 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 Mama, would you like to be my sunshine? Nigga, touch my game, we gon' turn this shit to Columbine Ice on my neck, cost me ten times three Thirty thousand dollars for a nigga to get free I, I just hit Rodeo and I spent like ten G's I just did a show and spent the check on my mama When I go and vacay, I might run out the Bahamas And I keep like ten phones, and I'm really never home All these niggas clones, tryna copy what I'm on Nigga, get your own, tryna pick a nigga bone the brother skip, boy, I had a good day Metro PCS, trapping ball, making plays Fifty shades of gray, beat that pussy like a hogan I know you know my slogan, if it ain't about what I'm gone Niggas hatin' cause I'm chosen Hey, <clears throat> making the french toast in the toaster oven Genius Rise and shine Hey Where's the remote to let the window work? No. <laughs> Breakfast ready. What you make? French toast, scrambled eggs, hash browns, and ham. Ham? With strawberries. Who eat ham at for breakfast? Canadian bacon. Come, come. Cheerio. Girl, don't tell me Chicago done made me try a bougie try. Cause you don't get no bougie than your mama, first of all. All right, we got some new boxy charm in. 
Y'all said y'all wanted me to go back and start doing my box of charm unboxings. So let's see what we get. So this is a boxy charm premium box. So let's see what we get in this. Boxy charm be putting me on to so many new products and stuff. I really appreciate them for this. Okay, so they sent some micellar cleansing treatment. This is a rinse with L, cardinine, micellar water, and vitamin B5. They sent this. This re retails for $45. It says this ultra cleansing liquid treatment works as a three in one cleanser, toner, and makeup removal. It helps s remove surface debris and unclog impurities from deep within the pores while smoothing and conditioning skin. It's left looking, feel, looking and feeling refreshed. Then they sent, oh, okay. They sent Kate Somerville's Eradicate Daily Flowing Cleanser, and this is an acne treatment. Okay, I'm excited to try this because it's an acne treatment. So this is medicated with 3% sulfur to help clear and prevent blemishes and draw out impurities to unclog congested pores. This retails for $44, okay. Okay, next they sent some Lawless Beauty Forget the Filler Lip Plumping Line Smoothing Gloss. This retails for $25. It says a clinically proven lip plumping treatment and ultra shining gloss with immediate and long-term plumping, softening, and hydrating benefits in a universally flattering sheer baby pink shade. Like I said, they retail for $25. Then we got a Saint Lux lip liner. What color is this in? Oh, it's two. Oh, so they sent two. They sent this brown, which is a, a nudie brown. It's like, it's really perfect, the perfect nudie brown. And then they sent a red. And y'all know I've been wearing red lipstick a lot lately. So, yes, the St. Lux Lip Liner Duo is $30. And then they sent the Complex Culture Executive Level Mascara. This retails for $28. Let's look at the one because the one is always important. I don't wear a lot of mascara, but when I do, I wear it on a lash line, and the one is always important for me. So this is the one. So honestly, like nothing really special about the one. And then we got a Sculpt Left Bar 24 Karat Gold, and this retails for $125. Wow. Let's look at that. So this is the packaging. It comes with a traveling case. So, um, what do you call those? A what do you call these? I forget what they call, but we just gonna say traveling case for right now. How you turn it on? Okay, so turn it on. Okay, it needs a battery. It doesn't come with a battery. Damn, okay. It doesn't come with a battery. But what I like about these little things is that, you know, when you put your serum on, you can pretty much do a nice lymphatic drainage massage. Because I don't know if you guys notice it, but when I wake up in the morning and I vlog, my face is swollen, my lips are swollen, like everything's swollen because I'm still kind of recovering from that tightening procedure. So like all of this usually swells up. So I have to like do lymph drainage massages. Also, when you get lip fillers, you can use this thing to basically, because fillers migrate out of your lips, right? So every week or so, or maybe twice a week, you should use one of these to like take and just push all fluid and blood flow back into your lips. 
and it will plump, plump your lips up. I'm not doing it right now because I don't need it, but I'm just showing you the the motions. Like you would just from here, from here, and just help increase that blood flow in the lips and push. Because you never really know like where the filler is migrating, so you just want to just make sure you take all areas of the face and push it back into your lips. You heard it here first. All right, this was a pretty good box. Out of everything I say, I would probably reorder. If this does well with my skin, I can see myself reordering this foam cleanser from Kate Somerville. Um, I've heard really good things about her skincare products. Um, I really feel like I could get CeraVe's or CeraVe's micellar water and it do the same job. I would not spend $45 on micellar water. Um, I definitely can see myself reordering the lip liners. If I like this, like if this really proves to plump your lips, I can't use it right now because I'm still recovering from my lip fillers. Um, so I don't really need it right now because my lips are on 10. But if this proves to like really plump your lips, I can see myself spending $25 and reordering this as well. As far as this, I wouldn't reorder it. You probably can find it on Amazon for cheaper. But the premium box was definitely a good box. Now I have another one. This is the regular box. You guys know in order to get the premium box, you have to already be signed up to get the regular box. So every month I get two boxes. Um, and this is what the regular box looks like. And you get five, three to five full size products in the regular box as well. So it's totally worth it. What is in this box? So first things first is a mini heat brush in the color apricot okay boxy charm all right now this is so cute this should have been in the premium this is so cute so you just plug it in and it's a heat brush so you know after you blow dry your hair you can basically use this to like flatten it out a little bit right before you flat iron it just to get it flatter before you put the iron on your hair and this retails for 150 dollars wow the box ain't even that much i think the box is 29 dollars this is 150 dollars and the boxy charm box isn't even that much it says this tool is perfect for on the go styling and touch ups it's as powerful and easy to use as a full size tool but compact enough to carry with you everywhere you go the rapid heat time and heat resistant bristles allow this cute handy brush to glide through your hair quickly and easily safe for all hair types welcome to your new favorite hair tool this is so cute and it comes with a, a nice dust bag that's what i was trying to say a dust bag it comes with a dust bag for traveling Wow, Box of Charm, I did they self with it. Box of Charm most definitely just I did they self with this box. This should have been in the premium box. Okay, what else did we get? So we got something from um, Ciate. I think you say it Ciate or Chiate. It's a velvet lip liner. This was $18 and I got it in the shade Coco. So let's see what color this is. I'm not really big on lip liners because when I use them, they break my, um, they, they cause my lip line to um, have blackheads, but this is the color. It's right there. So it's, it's uh, like a, a pinky nude. Next in the box is this Reveal Ultra Hydrating Cucumber Melon Gel Mask. So this looks pretty freaking fun. Let's look what the bottle look like. Okay. It says how to use. Apply a thick layer directly onto face and neck and leave on for 10 to 15 minutes. Gently massage in excess gel or remove by patting excess using a slightly damp face cloth or cotton pad. This is nice. So this is like those gel masks that you get at the spa. This retails for $28. 
It says it's fortified with hyaluronic acid, cucumber, and melon extracts. It refines the skin with hydration for finer looking pores and an overall healthy, radiant glow. Love that. Next, we got something from Luna Magic, and these are the hydrating lip balms in mango and cherry. So let's look how these, these are just lip balms. Okay, it says they're hydrating lip balms, but it look like when you, I, need, I definitely need to hydrate. My lips peeling so bad. Love these. It says, a hydrating, sheer, lightweight lip balm that leaves lips soft and lush, infused with vitamin E to nourish lips and formulated with jojoba oil. Is it jojoba or jojoba? I need to ask Siri so don't nobody correct me in the comments because y'all ain't gonna let me say nothing wrong, I swear. To heal dry lips and helps lock in moisture. Okay, love these. And then we got some, we got an eyeshadow palette from Item. Lord knows I don't need another eyeshadow palette, but let's see what it's looking like, Jai. Okay, this is perfect. Love, love, love the colors. This retails for $24. Um, let me swatch this. Oh, we it's pigmented. Look at that. I just swatched this one right here. It's real pigmented. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna be using this. Yeah. So out of everything, I probably would only reorder the gel mask. If you guys want to sign up, um, all you have to do is click the link in my description box to sign up. I don't get anything for it, but like re reward points, which I actually never use. But yeah, BoxyCharm will definitely put you onto some new, new products and their boxes are so worth it. Karen, come here, let me give you some uh, goodies. Okay, so I got Karen, me and Karen some walkie talkies cause she all the way on the first floor and I'm on the third and when I be in my bedroom, I be yelling, Karen, Karen. And she be acting like she don't even hear me. And I know she hear me. So I got her some walkie talkies. So, oh, they came with batteries. Look at this, look at God. So I got us some walkie talkies so we can communicate. I think that's the charger. Testing, testing. How the hell this damn thing work? Four. Testing, testing. Testing, there we go. Testing, testing. Got it. Testing, testing. Get it. Okay. Hey, I got us some walkie talkies. It's on the other side. Yeah. Mom. Yeah, you can hear me good? Yes. Okay, good. Okay, high five. Now when you need something, just call me. Okay. You still wanna go shopping? Yep. You still wanna go to the mall? Okay, let me go put some clothes on. Put that uh, towel in the bathroom. All right, we about to go in Nordy's and do a little shop shop. Uh-oh, we got it.
counting in the mood. Oh. Okay, I'm counting in the mood for some uh, fuzzy taco. You want some tacos? Maybe a burrito? Yeah. <laughs> Man, let's go to fuzzy taco. That's gonna be some good eating. What you say? I can't hear you. The food was so good. Oh, okay, when you're talking, you gotta keep pressing the button down until you finish talking. Okay. Taking less L's, making more M's. Put her skims on, then she acting like she can. You gonna drink your hot chocolate with a straw carrot? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so what you wanna watch? You said you wanna watch Beaches? Yep. Well, I'm gonna have to rent it because I don't think they got it on Prime right now. I really need to buy it. Me and Karen about to sit here and have us a movie night and watch Beaches. This is one of our favorite movies ever. I literally can watch Beaches all the way through and then press replay and watch it all the way through again. I could go to sleep to Beaches. It's just one of those comfort movies that just make you feel good. And it's funny. So we are here at the Moroccan Spa. This is her mom out in Frisco. Me and Karen are about to get um, her mom's signature baths. I think I'm gonna try the henna one today, which gives you like a subtle tan and it's good for scarring. And then Karen is gonna get the her mom's signature um, bath. So this is gonna be really good because um, she had like casts on her legs because they were trying to straighten her flat feet. Not something that I actually approved of, but that's something that she got um, done. And I just really feel like her legs really need to be exfoliated real good. So we're here to get a Moroccan bath. Y'all know I do these once a month. I don't always vlog when I do them, but we're trying something new today. So when you come, they do give you a disposable bra and panty, a wrap to wrap around in, and then you get some shower shoes as well. Your daughter? Mm -hmm. Is she your daughter? Mm-hmm. Oh, she looks just like you. <laughs> yeah, my twin. Why is she thinking I should have stayed? But you know it's all my mind, so. Because my skin is really, really dry after I get these baths. So I just brought this because it's really thick and hydrating and moisturizing. You haven't got your tea yet? Not yet, no. Okay, thank you. Put some lotion on your feet. You like bacabla? Bacabla. You like it? It's good, huh? Hmm. I think I see it right. Take kind of hot, be careful. Alright, we are all done and headed back to the house. How did you like it, Karen? 
good. That was good. The exfoliating wasn't um too harsh for you. No. No. Yeah, it feels really good. I do these once a month. Gotta stay on top of it. I ain't have any um dead skin this time though. I've been staying on top of my body scrubs from Skin Potion and my um I think that's your seat belt. And my um body scrubs from my vitamin E body scrub from Joe Malone. That body that body scrub so doggone good y'all oh my gosh it is so good and moisturizing don't you come out of here <laughs> but yeah let me pay attention to the road we about to head home i just want to stop at whole foods really quick and get some vitamin e oil and mm -hmm, and um tea tree oil okay i'm back at the house i just did my little nighttime skincare routine so y'all have been tagging me like crazy on this viral tiktok about this girl washing her face with dow soap mixed with um tea tree oil and vitamin e oils so she mix it all together in her hand lather it up and put it on her face now, she didn't share her moisturizer, which I feel like is very important. See, share your moisturizer because, I mean, you can't leave that out. You got to moisturize. But I end up using the moisturize, moisturizer that I bought from Dubai because he said that it's really good for my skin. So, that's that little glow, y'all. See, honey, she's glowing. Okay, yeah, but I'm ready for it to go ahead and start working. Ma'am showed her results a week later. Listen, I've been checking my skin every 30 minutes. Because one thing about my skin, it's going to tell me if it don't like something really fast. Like, I look up and I don't remember that pimple was there 30 minutes ago. You know what I'm saying? So, I can't wait to see the results. I'm definitely going to try it because she, she, the girl on TikTok said she had tried everything similar to the things that I've tried. So, I was like, hell, let me find out. Dow soap do it it makes sense though because tea tree oil is antibacterial and antiviral i think um dow is antibacterial soap as far as we know and um vitamin e oil helps with like scars and um is really good to just moisturize your face it's a good moisturizer and my face doesn't feel tight or or extremely dry which that's what i was thinking that the dial soap would do it like dry it out but it doesn't feel irritated or anything so i'm excited to see if this actually works and i will keep you guys updated because i'm about to be using it for the next 30 days um to see how my skin reacts because my skin does not like skin better it does not um and i did have um some purging i don't know if these were breakouts or was it purging but i was using the dove uh moisturizing bar soap and um yeah my skin didn't take well to that so i'm gonna try this and see <sighs> lord let, please let this work because i'm so sick of spending my money on skin girl Jersey! 